Okay, so what's your name? Lois Johnson. Why do you want Phil Hart gone? Because he's a... Can I say that? You can... Because hey, we have free speech. <laughs> well, I had to write in against yeah. him. And unfortunately, only took 25% of the vote. Are you, you Howard Griffith? Yeah. Yes, I am. Awesome. Uh, so why, why does Hart need to be gone? We pay our taxes well, and his salary. He needs to pay his taxes. He hasn't paid his taxes for 10 off. years. Yeah. Timber off the endowment for school kids. You know, he's supposed to be representing us, and he's doing a poor job. As far as I'm concerned, and I got a letter into the Attorney General right now. I got a letter into the Attorney General right now asking for uh, the Governor or the Attorney General to remove him from office because he broke his oath, because he was supposed to uphold the Constitution of the United States and the state of Idaho, and he's broken it. As far as, if I can't do it as a write-in, well, I'm coming back next year and it won't be a write-in. Well, let me ask you this. Um, the 1996 timber theft, that was before he was a, a representative, right. right? Should that still count against him? Yes, it should. Why is that? Because it ne he never even paid, the only reason he even paid a donation, which is a tax deductible on, on top of it, if you want to look at it that way, he waited because he knew that was just another new rope to hang up. And that's the reason he even did that. It, you know, he, when this came out in the Star, the Raftum Star, unfortunately, I didn't realize all this until after the primary. Uh -huh. And then when I found out about it, and I said, enough's enough. I'm sick of what I'm seeing coming out of Washington. And we got to start taking care of our own backyard. And that's, you know, you got to draw a line somewhere. And I don't care what party you are. When you're wrong, you know, you're wrong. So. A after this uh, next ethics panel, you'd like to see Hart completely gone. You think you think he's? You <clears throat> we need some. You know, it's a house. People live in the house, that, like District Three. You know, they vote for somebody to put that person in the office to represent them, and he is not good representation. As a matter of fact, as far as I'm concerned, he's an embarrassment to District Three, and that's unfortunate. And if I had more money for the campaign and got a flyer out to all the registered voters, I wouldn't be standing here right now, believe me.